All right, this video is about combination notation. So we're going to be starting binomial expansion. And in that, we're going to be using combination notation to create coefficients. So we're going to get used to it with our calculator. So this is just the notation. And this is the one we're going to be using. And it means n comma r. And so it's n choose r. It'll look this way in our calculator, just like this. So how we're going to do that is we're going to take our calculator and we're going to hit math probability and then number three and it will pop right up so just like this so we're going to look at it first and then we're going to do it so it's math and then you scroll left to probability and then number three this is our combination notation and so you're going to put the numbers in there so we're going to do 10 and two and so what this means is if you had 10 things how many different ways could you choose two of them 45 different ways. So that is our combination notation. All right, so let's try a few. We're going to do 10, choose 2, 5, choose 3, 6, choose 4. The larger number will always be bigger than the smaller because you can't choose more than you don't have. So we already did 10, choose 2, and we got 45. Now let's try 5, choose 3. So same thing, math, scroll left twice, number 3. And then five, choose three. So five, scroll left, three, hit enter. There you go, it's 10. And then math, scroll left twice, number three. And then we're gonna put in six, choose four. So on each of these, this is red, six, C, four. It's another way of writing it. So six, choose four it's all notation so if you had six items how many different ways can you pick four of them that would be 15 and that's it so this is how we're going to be using it when you look at these you plug them in your calculator thank you